remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? If you have not done so already, after you subscribe, there's a little bell next to your subscribe button. Go ahead and click on that thing so you can get your notifications each time I drop a new video like this. Make sure you click all notifications. Otherwise, you may not get any notifications. That's the way YouTube works. Also, smash up the likes, smash up the likes, smash up the likes. It helps with the video positioning on YouTube. That way we get it in front of everybody. You did. We, won't need, we need eyeballs, family. Eyeballs. Now let's get right on into it. Police are looking for a man who robbed a pizza spot in Seattle. This is a very interesting case, family. Here's why. The man comes through a back door that's unlocked while the manager is counting money. The interesting and most strangest part of this story is that the manager was fighting the dude as if that money was hers personally. Like that money was to save her house from being repossessed or to pay for a life-saving surgery of a loved one. I mean, she was fighting. Every time he pushed her off him, she jumped back on him. Reminds me of a case way back in the day that I can't really talk about. But why would somebody do that? And here's something else that's strange. Right after the dude left out, the employees come, come in like right on cue as if they knew something that the manager was unaware of. I'll put a link in the description so you can check it out for yourself. But it just strikes me as strange that the back door just happened to be unlocked and dude walked right in and robbed the place. They didn't hear any of the scuffling, the employees. The other employees didn't hear any scuffling. I mean, they was going at it. They didn't hear any screaming and hollering and furniture moving around or nothing. And this went on for a while. Then all of a sudden, as the, after the dude leave, they come walking in. Sounds like an inside job to me. But what say you, family? Do you think it was an inside job? You know a lot of these robberies that occur are inside jobs. Back doors are just not left unlocked. Back doors of businesses that deal with cash. Pretty much back doors that of any kind of businesses that are restaurants especially those doors are not just unlocked unlocked and uh, unmanned something is very very strange about this case I wonder if they'll ever find him I don't think they will I think if they find dude it'll be for a another burglary, another robbery. I think that if he had killed that woman, they would find him. Because, you know, like after you, like robbery, I mean, you know, a lot of places get robbed. Places, people get robbed all the time. Uh, it's only when there's a murder is when the authorities uh, use more resources and they take it more seriously. Because I personally believe that, in their mind, if there's going to be any killing done around here, uh, we're going to do it. So I think that when common folks start killing, uh, I think that they get offended. Like, That's our job. What are you doing? But what say you, family? Do y'all think this was an inside job? Check out the video. Leave your comments. 
No more talk. What the ladies talking about?